A few people have asked me about the pain during labor and I decided uh, to do a video about it. Um, some people wanted to know if the pain is manageable or not. And uh, the best way I can explain it is, uh, for especially for women, is the, is the period cramps that you get. I, I started to have those period cramps even the day before I went into labor and I thought they were breast and hicks but they, they weren't. So. Um, at the beginning, those pains are a lot like period pains, like cramps. And they are, if you start slowly, they, they come in waves and they go. And it's very much like you're getting your period. And as the labor progresses, um, me personally, I'm talking about my experience, uh, it started to, uh, those pains started to feel more intense. There were no point where I thought, uh, I can't handle this. The pain is uh, different from the pain you would have, for instance, if you have broken a leg or something. That is a pain that you know, okay, I need to go to the hospital, I need to get this fixed. For, for this kind of pain, it's a different feeling. For, to me, it, it helped me understand what my body was doing. Once I knew what my body was doing, I, I understood the pain, I wasn't afraid of it as much and to me it was much easier to, to, to deal with it. So once you take the fear factor out of the equation, it, the pain becomes a lot more, you understand it more, and becomes a lot more bearable. So there is a point where, as I say, those uh, contra contractions, those uh, surges, some people call them, they get more painful. And it is pain, you do feel pain. It's just um, it's just those cramps getting more intense, but you also know that the baby is coming, that, that you know that things are progressing. So if if you have like a positive feeling about the whole thing, it actually you think like every surge is actually getting you closer to your baby. It's how you translate that pain into something. So that's what helped me deal. Uh, that's what helped me dealing with 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 the sensations I was feeling. It, this was my first child, and to me everything was very new. So that's the the best way to explain it. And uh, there is a moment where it goes from from intense cramping to a feeling or an urge to push that they call it. And I before I gave birth, I really didn't know is my body actually going to do the pushing for me. And it does. The truth is that it does. Your body starts to push in a way that you've never pushed before. And the best thing you can do, in my experience, is just to let it do its work. Our bodies are actually made for this. They're pretty smart. You just let it do the work and, and it does do the work for you. So I did have this urge to push and I just, and you still have these searches. They come and they go and, and but now they're different. They, they just, you just feel like pushing and you just let the body do the push for you. The good thing is that you do have breaks in between. For some women are uh, big breaks, for other women are not, are, are kind of closer together. Depends on how fast your labor is. But your body kind of gives you a break in between. I would say there are two parts in labor. The first part where you have those cramping uh, pains and you do feel like it's like uh, your period is coming, but you know, fifty thousand times more intense. And there are, there is a point, and and every woman I was told that I actually did reach that point where you think, I can't do this. I actually, I can't do this. I don't know if it's hormonal or not, but there's a point where you actually feel like you can't do this. I was surrounded by, uh, by somebody that that was there with me and and told me that yes you can do this and it really just it, I, it just lasts for a few seconds I would I was gonna say minutes but it's not even minutes it's seconds that feeling lasts for a few seconds and then you are completely overwhelmed by this feeling of this shot of adrenaline that that urges you to push all of a sudden so it, the hormones do the work it's amazing how you go from from feeling this pain to maybe all of a sudden thinking you can't do it and then all of a sudden you start, you know, you feel a lot more empowered and think, yeah, actually I can do this and I'm going to start pushing. And so what I did is just to, to let my let my body do the work 
and it worked <laughs> it worked pretty well it did whatever it needed to do my uh, advice to you is to to do the research to understand um, what your body is doing to get to 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 feel not so much fear but uh, excitement about what's coming and and once you get that fear factor away it's an experience that you might not feel ever again it's it's uh it's very intense and and you can actually enjoy it enjoy it sorry or you can be afraid of it and if you choose to enjoy it it's just your, your mind kind of clicks and it everything feels different so yes it does feel painful but it is bearable and there are as you probably know there are many ways of dealing with pain and if you deal with it with fear then i think it's gonna probably feel a lot more painful than it should be. The whole experience changed me and even though it was very painful, uh, you do come out of it uh, as, a, as a very empowered being. To me, uh, it kind of clicked in my brain. If I can do this, I can do anything. I hope this doesn't sound too silly, but I did become a lot more empowered to do anything else after this. It's a feeling that if you're pregnant, every woman should go through. You feel uh, limitless. You feel you can do anything. And uh, to me, it was amazing to feel this way. So I, uh, I hope I have described it uh, in, a, in a, an understanding way. I hope you can understand me. And if you have any questions, just ask me. <laughs>